Okay, and now we have Phoenix as well at home. Six-point favorites against the Mavs. Chin May, who are you backing? I do think the Suns ultimately win this game, but against the spread, I do have to take the Mavs. I think they found something with their perimeter shooting and they found something with their defensive adjustments. Chris Paul should bounce back, but I don't know that he's going to have the type of game that he had in game two, where everybody was, you know, anointing him as the best player in the league all of a sudden. So I do think the Suns ultimately win this game at home, but I like Dallas to cover the spread here. I think the Mavs have, have found a formula that works for them, and, and they're going to stick to it and, and should play pretty well in this game. All right, Maddie. Suns are a significant favorite here in Game 5, but you have Luka looking prime for a bounce-back spot here. Yeah, I'm just going to evade this question because I think the line is just correct at 6. I think this is basically what it should be. Uh, the take I will give, though, is that I think both of these teams are way underpriced to win the Western Conference. Like, the Warriors have played two teams that – are not on their level now with John Morant not playing. I don't think the Grizzlies are that close. And and, the, and they just haven't looked good. Denver was about as easy of a, of a matchup as they could have gotten in the first round. And I'm not even sure that the Warriors are better than the Mavericks, much less the Suns. So the Warriors right now are minus 120 to win the West. I think that's just pretty ridiculous. And I like Suns plus 140. I like Mavericks plus 850. Um, I do lean towards the Suns winning this series um the odds obviously indicate that too but yep. whoever does wind up winning this series i think makes for a really good betting opportunity in the next round assuming they play golden state 